My Parkinson's started when I was around 37 years old. I had gotten so bad I was crawling around the house. The pain would radiate from the back down the left leg. I went to Holy Cross Hospital for treatment of my epilepsy. It saved my life. Not only changed my life, it saved my life. What this neuroscience program means for the community is a comprehensive, high quality level of care in a very sophisticated specialty. My dream is that we are known outside Montgomery County, outside the state of Maryland, outside of Washington, D.C., as a place where you can get high quality care, that we're a destination for people to come to for neuroscience care. The neuroscience program at Holy Cross Hospital is serving as a model for the rest of the hospitals in the state of Maryland, utilizing the latest technology for the excellent patient care. And my role is to guide and foster this collaborative effort that we have started and created. As a primary stroke center, we have the whole range of the services, which starts from immediately attending to the patient and evaluating the patient, admitting them and providing excellent care, and then discharging them with all the education that they need, which will further advance their care and recovery. I had spine surgery at Holy Cross Hospital. I started to feel more pain, and the only comfortable way I could walk was to bend forward, you know, like a little old lady. In Raquel's surgery, she had a minimally invasive laminectomy and a minimally invasive fusion. What that means is we went in there and took the narrow spinal canal, which is really small, and enlarged it and gave the nerves lots of room. The second thing we did was we had a stabilizer spine. I could get up without feeling any pain whatsoever. I thought that uh, having the surgery would inhibit me from a lot of the projects and uh, activities that I had before, but I went to church two weeks after the surgery and on the third week I was singing. I think a neurologist is a detective in many ways. Patients come to us with specific complaints that are oftentimes hard to sort out. Well, as a physician, it's important to me to know that I'm helping people. Every patient should have every opportunity to receive the treatments that might make them better or cure them of their disease. I've had epilepsy since I was in my 20s, and Dr. Matthews suggested that I go to the Holy Cross Hospital Monitoring Unit, you know, but I knew I was in the right place at the right time. Some patients will benefit from medications. Some patients will benefit from surgery. Every patient will benefit from careful attention and proper diagnosis of the condition. He said all it was was a simple change of medication. It was a great feeling, a truly great feeling. Deep brain stimulation is a low-risk procedure where we implant electrodes in the brain that act like a pacemaker to improve the symptoms of Parkinson's disease and other movement disorders. I started a deep brain stimulation program here in Washington, D.C., and we were the first full-blown DBS program, and people fly in from all over to have me instruct them on in how to perform the procedure. So it, it's, been, uh, it's been wonderful. Right after surgery, I got up and I walked right out of that hospital. Dr. Levine is a miracle worker. He's just giving me my life back. Holy Cross being so close to me, it's like a godsend. It's just phenomenal. I love it. All the nurses, the doctors, they're just totally outstanding. They were there by my side every step of the way. 